Hey, what is up heroes and welcome to Pokemon Evolve Eevee, a game jam game made for the Relic Castle game jam. If you guys want to play along, link in the description down below, make sure to check them out and also check out Relic Castle's game jam games because there's so many brand new games for you guys to play. And this game here is one I've had my eye on for some time. It has looked so good, I cannot wait to jump into it because we get to play as Eevee. And I love Pokemon games where you get to play as Pokemon, like Mystery Dungeon games, I love that. And this is a game where you play as an Eevee. Your goal is to prove to yourself and to everyone that Eevees are better than their evolutions. Oh yeah they are. <laughs> you travel the small region of... Mycin? Mycian? Small region of Mycian and try to battle and defeat the three evolutions. Vaporeon, Jolteon, and Flareon. Each tougher than the last. The further you travel, the harder your adventure gets. Alright, here we go, the opening. <laughs> oh, Eevee's so adorable. Let's go. Whoa, 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 where do you think you're going, mister? What? Who are you? I am, um, well, I am you. I am, the best way to explain it is that I am, I guess, your conscience? That's how you put it, at least. Okay, then if you're my conscience, then what are you doing? I'm stopping you from leaving the daycare. I'm protecting you from anything that could harm you. Well, if you really want to protect me, then you could teach me all about these things that are supposedly bad. That's not a good idea. Here it is! You can teach me everything I need to know about this world. Well... If that's what will protect you, then okay. I will teach you what you would need. Should you not want to come back to the daycare? Hey, I thought something that else that you can teach me. Oh yeah, what's that? You can teach me how to battle. Whoa, definitely not. What, why not? I've always wanted to uh, be a battler. One day I want to prove to the humans that being an Eevee is not that bad. Especially in Pokemon Insurgents. Oh, I love my Mega Eevee. Gotta say, it's so good. But, oh yeah, so I suppose I teach you how to battle. How would you prove that to the uh, humans? I would battle and beat the evil or evolutions of me and prove that Eevees are actually better. Because when I get caught, I don't ever want to evolve. Okay, I'll teach you how to battle. I'll teach you everything you want to know and then you can battle your evolutions and prove that Eevees are better. Oh, thank you, Conscience. Don't call me that. Fine. <laughs> Alright. Oh, okay, if you want to learn how to battle, then first things first, you need to know about Long Grass. Long Grass? What is that? Long Grass is where wild Pokemon live. When you walk through it, you have a chance to encounter a Pokemon. When that happens, you need to attack it. The wild Pokemon will use attacking moves, and so that's what you need to do too. Okay, I got it. When you defeat a Pokemon, you will gain experience points, and you will then eventually level up. When you level up, you have a chance to gain some more moves. Those moves will be more powerful, and will help you battle stronger Pokemon. Okay, I'm ready to battle. There is uh, some long grass up ahead. Why don't you ba battle in that? Uh, what's inside this house first? I know it's a daycare, but... Oh. Okay, I guess we gotta learn how to battle first. <laughs> so I go in there, okay. I want to grab that item first as well. No more gem, eh? Ooh, yay, a shiny gem. This gem is a normal gem. You can power up your normal type moves. It's only for one move, isn't it, though? Yeah, only once. Yeah, don't use that just yet. We'll save that for, like, a, uh, I guess, an evolution to battle. Time to battle. I'm, gonna lie, I'm kind of getting some, like, Steve the Barrel vibes, which, man, I love that game. Alright, let's go for some tackles. Pidgey ain't gonna stand a chance. So I wonder if Nurse Joy will heal us. I mean, obviously we're gonna have to find a way to heal up at some point, but... I like the little, um... The battle box as well, it says like, fight bag and stuff. Looks really nice, just a little, uh... Bits, like how it opens up. That looks really cool, I like that. I like that a lot. Can attack, come on Eevee, don't miss. Don't miss, please don't miss. No, we miss, of course. Of course we miss. No, we missed again, seriously. Stop with the sand attacks, I can't deal with it. <laughs> it's killing me. It's not killing me, it's making me miss. Oh my god, come on. Oh, this Pidgey. This Pidgey is the worst Pidgey in all of existence. Come on, one more tackle. Just land the tackle, yes. Woo. Oh my goodness, that was difficult. Okay. So we learned how to battle. Can we heal up in here? What up, Nurse Joy? Oh, you nod your head. <laughs> oh, wow. It's like, yep. You can heal me up, it's all good. So, where are we going? We can go south, or maybe we can go north up a cave, and there's a human there. Should we talk to the human? What up? Oh, how cute, little Eevee came to say hello to me. <laughs> Ah, oh, little do they know we're on a quest. Of course, though, like, Eevee's quite lucky. Like, I know everyone wants to evolve their Eevees, but 
A lot of people always put favorite Pokemon is Eevee. Eevee's just so adorable. I know my girlfriend's favorite Pokemon is Eevee, and she's got a shiny Eevee. She's never gonna evolve. Just gonna keep it how it is. And I have all the plushes I've got. I mean, I have an Eevee from Builder Bear. Well, not really mine, but uh, my ones. Just looking, I got Espeon and Umbreon because they're my two favorite evolutions. But oh, we got this little Sylveon as well. Sylveon's adorable. But gotta say, I, I think I probably bef I don't know. I love Espeon and Umbreon. But ever since Pokemon Insurgents using Mega Eevee, I've just I've just fallen in love with Eevee more than them two a little bit. It's really annoying. <laughs> but if I had to evolve Eevee, it would either be an Espeon or Umbreon. It would be like a to uh, coin toss. I'm going to decide on my own. Because I love them two so much. We've got Return. Return. Ooh, that's a TM. So this that you contain a specific move, you can probably learn that. Return is good, man. Return is so good. Actually, it depends if our Eevee... Yeah. Well, it depends if the Eevee likes itself, because if it likes itself, it's going to have max happiness and then it's going to uh, do a lot more damage. Let's give it a helping hand. I mean, I kept a return on my Mega Eevee on Insurgents because it's just so good. So good, man. Alrighty then. So I, I say we try and go through the cave first. We'll take out a few Pidgeys on the way. If they get too annoying, we'll run away, but I'm just hoping. Not that bad. Return! Please do a lot of damage. Eh, it's not bad. I think there's more than tackle, so we'll keep spamming that return for a little bit. I wonder if there's a map in the Pokemon Center as well, so we can just look at to see where to go. Because I have absolutely no idea. I would, I would assume maybe through the cave, because it's right next to Daycare and Pokemon Center. But you never know. All this tall grass. And we made it. Can we run? Oh, we can run. Nice. Didn't even realize. A lot like Pokemon Fang is of rum hacks nowadays, I just forget, you know, to run at the start because I always think, when are we going to get the running shoes and just wait for that, you know, our mum to be like, yo, where's the running shoes? But a lot of games nowadays just have it straight from the start, which is the best thing ever. Whew. Okay, defense dropped. That's fine. We can, we can beat a Raz. Have we take any more damage that we're going to have to heal up? Oh, never mind. Critical hit. 41 XP, okay. Oh, so you like, you like scary caves then, I see. Well, if I want to get stronger, then I have to conquer my fear of scary caves, right? If that's what floats your boat, then go ahead. I will. <laughs> Alright, going for the spooky cave. Don't be Geodudes, or just like Zubats. Oh, Shan Sanshrews? We can, we can beat Sanshrews, probably. It won't be too difficult. Uh, let's go for a return. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm running away. We're not going to be able to beat this. No, thank you. Oh, hi. I've been training these caves looking for a wild Pokemon. It's just my luck that an Eevee appears. I'm going to catch you for sure. Oh, can try, my friend. You can try. Do a matchup. Yeah, you're probably going to do it, though, to be fair. You're going to do it. <laughs> oh, we're pretty weak as well. Oh, you got free Pokemon? You expect me to beat this guy? I feel like I'm going to do a bit of grinding. We can take low kicks easy though, but... I feel like if we lose... Which we're probably going to lose. I might just like... Spend good 25 minutes... Grinding. And then we'll continue the video off. Because otherwise we're going to just struggle. I mean, luckily the uh, the fight moves aren't, you know, doing too much damage. Scratch can't do less than four. Two. Oh, we're not gonna beat it, but we can try. Get a crit, get a crit. Oh, so close. So close. Final thought, game over. Game over, Eevee was caught. All right, so I'm gonna uh, do some grinding. And I'll see you guys back in a little bit. Alright, I'm back, done a lot of training, now Eevee is level 10, gonna be kicking some butt. I found her tackle does a lot more than return, so um, she'll start going for tackle more often. <laughs> I think we'll start using return when Eevee likes himself a little bit more, and then we can actually do a lot more damage. But right now tackle is just the go-to move. Oh, it's Krogunk, that's pretty cool, it's gonna die. 
Yeah! Tackle too good. Tackle too good. Tough Pokemon are hard to catch. Yep. Good. Okay. Let's run a little bit. And we can't go that way. It's a dead end, so we're not going through the cave. I don't need to run. Gotta take some Pokemon out on the way. I mean, we've got 35 PP for um, Tackle, so... Don't mind just doing some damage here and there. So we're going south. Oh. That's probably a good idea to take all these Pokemon out, just get the XP and um, grow a few levels here and there. Because if it's going to be gonna be just us, just us versus all these uh, Pokemon, it's probably a good idea we'd be as OP as possible. <laughs> Almost level 11, noise. Alright, here we go. What's this? We have Super Repel. Not bad, I'm not going to use it just yet, but we'll hold on to that for later on. Don't mind, uh... Dude, I'm going to quickly turn the PlayStation off as well. There you go, sorry. Just... Uh, I have three PlayStation 4s, don't ask why, but one of them, which is the main one for watching TV on, just... Sometimes it likes to... sound like it's about to self-destruct. <laughs> don't know if you can hear some of that now, like, hopefully it will just turn itself on in a second, but... Man, it's annoying. So, Volution Town. The opening? Okay. Wait, what's this? Can we get a berry from this tree? Hey, orange berries. Nice. I like how the little, you can see the berries on the tree and when you pick them up they disappear. Volution Town, okay. What's in here? Evolution Man for all your evolving needs. Oh, it's locked. Okay, let's quickly go heal up though. So in case we lose we can just come back here. So find that adorable after you heal up, just like nod your head like, yep, I want to be healed. Got a soup potion, brilliant. So Eevee, that's what the humans call a potion. Can heal you up, and I'll save you walking to the Pokemon Center and helping help in there. Okay, good. Oh, what up, dude? Oh yes, I'm the mood leader. I can make Pokemon forget their moves. Now I'm good. But kind of funny. <laughs> find it kind of funny how we can talk to like Eevee, but <laughs> it's all good. Yo, what up? I'm an explorer. I love discovering new places. Just got home. F uh, Fro from a small break before I head back out. Oh man. I'm kind of jealous to get to explore these places. Oh, there's Vaporeon. Okay, there's a Vaporeon. Are you ready to battle it? Let's do it! That's the spirit. Uh, but not before we finish exploring the town though. I wish we go talk to everyone, then we'll battle Vaporeon. Uh, some more berries in the tree. Let's quickly grab that. I'm thinking. Should we put the normal gem on now, or should we save that for later on? Have a berry, because I feel like maybe we're a bit too OP right now, so... I'm thinking what we'll do is we'll give Eevee a berry to hold. Yo, what up, girl? Me, I'm not a trainer. Everyone in this, uh, this town is a trainer. They always go exploring. It gets really lonely sometimes. I can tell it's quite an empty place. Oh, another Pokeball. Oh, Meowth. Yo, what up, Meowth? What up? I'm going to take you out just so we get level 11. So we know we're ready to take on Vaporeon. Ooh. I'm going to heal up as well. Just get that extra 5 HP back. You never know. You never know that 5 HP could definitely help against Vaporeon. Level 11. Sweet. And we got Toxic. Oh my god, yes. Pretty sure Eevee can learn Toxic, right? Because that's going to be super good. Yes, it is. going to stool. And just keep popping them potions and stool. <laughs> Toxic stool. I am a terrible person. But nice. Okay. What I might do as well is after the first episode of this, I might just run around in circles for a, a little while just to gain my happiness up and then hopefully return can just hoo -hoo, do the damage. But let's go take on Vaporeon. You ready? You ain't even that good of an evolution. Actually, Vaporeon's pretty good. I love my big competitive Vaporeon. <laughs> Wish protect toxic scold. Yeah, too good. <laughs> you want to go Vaporeon? What level are you? 12. Okay. All right, so we're going to go for a uh, toxic first just to, you know, do the little uh, bit of damage each turn. I'm going to growl me. Okay, that's annoying, but it's fine. Toxic's doing its damage. I was actually going to tail whip you a little bit just to uh, bring your defense down. Okay, only seven damage is fine. Gonna go for another tail whip. 
Do we have another growl? That's fine, keep, keep stalling them growls, because the toxic's gonna just slowly do that damage. Find that toxic TM was the best thing possible for this battle right now. How much damage do we even do to Vaporeon? Oh, <laughs> critical hit! <laughs> Let's go, baby! Oh my god! Get destroyed, son! Oh. One out of eight. Oh yeah, one down, only two left. Wait, what? Why is it one out of eight? That was a great battle, you did awesome. Oh, is it eight evolutions? Um, wait, Vaporeon, Jordion, Flareon, Espeon, Umbreon, Leafeon, Glaceon, Sylveon. Yeah, there's eight. Unfortunately for us, the stone that won't work, uh, we would have to go see the Evolution Man if you wanted to use that. Though I don't think he's home. Okay, so where should we go next? Next evolution on our list is Jolteon. I believe Jolteons are found just north from here. So let's go there next. Okay. So I know this game, I think I said at the beginning, I need mean, Flareon, Jolteon, and Vaporeon. That'd be awesome, just saying. The next game jam. Next next year, I think it'll be next, another next year. If uh, you make e, Evolve EV2, take on Espeon and Umbreon. Turn you've got time, make it Leafeon, Glaceon, and uh, Sylveon. Now you're going to move to Lee, already done you. Alright, start making our way up a little bit. Let's go grab that. Oh, helps if I press the right button. Hidden power, ooh. I wonder what hidden power is going to be, but I've never been a big fan of the move, hidden power. So has got Origin Cave and Ocean Town self. Okay. Uh, little ball there. Yo, what up, man? I've been training this canyon for months, and it's just my luck, and Eevee appears. It's just your bad luck. You ain't going to catch me, my friend. Oh, you're a trap inch. Okay. Level 10, that's not bad. That's not bad. Let's go for them tackles. Yeah, I think for the next episode, there were definitely a bit more. I think the majority on Pro will be level like 15 or so. Back on, oh, you better not know Dragon Rage or it's, or it's over. You even have to use the Berry against uh, Vaporeon. <laughs> that critical hit was just too strong. Too strong! Tough Pokemon are hard to catch. Yes, they are. Okay, what's this? We got a... Light. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I don't know if we should use a life orb or not. It could be good. It could be really good, but I don't know. Because I feel like we'd end up doing more damage to ourselves over time. I think maybe just against we put it on against like maybe Jolteon or Flareon. But training, definitely not. Right now we won't use it. Because that Pokemon we're taking on, we end up just uh, killing ourselves over, you know, six, seven battles. Don't want that. And I would like to wake up. Come on, Sunkern. Sunkern, don't be a guy. Don't be that guy. Come on. Oh, he's being that guy. Being that guy. <sighs> so just wants to not die. Keep me asleep for five turns. Oh my god, dude. Why are you gonna be like this? Hey, we woke up. Come on. Give me a crit. Finish it off. Finish him. Oh, you're serious. Put me back to sleep. Oh, this, this, this Sunkern. This Sunkern, Sunkern is the worst Sunkern ever. I'm even tired of saying its name. Oh my god, it's gonna be killing me, isn't it? Come on. Eevee, wake up! You beat it at level 13. Oh, come on. <laughs> come on! Just one more tackle. Wake up. Oh my god, Eevee. I'm getting the worst luck. The sand attacks earlier against the Pidgey, and now the, uh. <laughs> being asleep against Sunkern, this is not cool. Come on. Woke up. Oh, I thought we were gonna miss for a second then. If we missed, if we missed, I would not be one happy Eevee. Alright, quick attack. I'm gonna say no to quick attack because I quite like my moveset as it is right now. Maybe in the future? Wait, I think we go down and get an item, can't we? Yeah. Get hail. Okay. Don't really want hail, but we're good. Kakuna, it's gonna run away from that actually. I should really be a Kakuna. Before it beat that easy. Modern. Uh, yeah, we should better finish off one more tackle. I feel like we should be able to. Nice. How much XP? 114. Not bad. You have to find another hiker in a second. Yo, what up? Love marshmallows. They're squishy. And, and east to eat. The east to eat. <laughs> I I don't know. I don't know. I'm like on the fence of marshmallows. Sometimes I can eat them, but sometimes it's make me feel super sick.
I'm pretty sure this guy's got three Pokemon to have a Chimchar next, won't he? Let's see the Pokemon Center before we get into this. There's an Origin Cave. How do you... Okay, can't get there. We can go this way and grab full heal. Oh, I'd rather not... I don't know the battle, nice. There's Jolteon. Okay, maybe the uh, the way unlocks after we beat Jolteon. Not too sure. But I think I'm going to throw it here. Next episode, going to um, do a little bit of grinding. And then we're going to take on Jolteon. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great day. Peace.